Hello, fishermen. This is Lang Solberg, commercial fisherman and business development manager for Deckhand Pro. We're going to show you how to start an EVTR using Deckhand Pro on the iPad. So when you get to your boat in the morning and you're getting ready to leave, warming up the engine, you can go ahead and tap Deckhand Pro from the iPad home screen, as you can see here in the top left-hand corner. When you open Deckhand Pro, you'll be brought to a home screen looking like this one. As you're still warming up and getting ready to leave, you can go ahead and complete the first part of your EVTR by tapping Go Fishing. We have messages spread, like, spread throughout the app looking just like this one. Uh, we intend to make the messaging friendly and easy to understand to help guide you through the EVTR process. When you're done reading each message, you can just tap Continue. This is the trip details section of the EVTR. You can see that the operator, vessel, and trip type are all remembered from previous trips, so you don't have to enter them every time. But if you need to change any one of these fields, you can just tap the black boxes on the right-hand side to select your entry. So for example, if we need to, to change trip type, we can just tap the box where it says commercial, and we can change it to, for example, charter. Notice that when we change it to charter, we get a second uh, box that comes up under number of crew that also asks us to input number of anglers. We'll go ahead and change it back to commercial just for this example. Next, the one field that isn't remembered is number of crew. Go ahead and tap the black box on the right, enter the number of crew, and touch the enter button in the bottom right hand corner. Season start date is something you don't have to necessarily enter. It's for your own use later on when you look at your catch analytics with Deckhand for your own personal sake. But uh, for this example, I think we'll just go ahead and leave it where it is for now. And that is how you fill out the trip details section of an EBTR. We'll tap continue. And we'll stop the video here, pick it up where we left off on the next one when we discuss how to actively fish using Deckhand Pro. Thanks for joining us and thanks so much for fishing with Deckhand Pro.